It's tradition here in Nashville. John Hurley getting us underway with the guitar riff tonight. Nashville SC and Inter Miami on a gorgeous Wednesday night at Geodis Park. Giveaway by Miami. Davis gets it to Mukhtar. Now Mukhtar driving forward, holds off Arroyo. Over to Pico. Pico curling it wide. But I think the longer you go on these unbeaten runs, the way Phil Neville has with a depleted roster, it just builds character, it builds belief in what you were doing, and then you have the ability, when you get money, to spend it in the right way. Here comes Nashville. Bumberry keeping it himself on his left foot, sends it wide. Katoy over the top. Mukhtar settling as Bumberry behind him. Oh, what a oh. turn! Sensational goal from Nashville SC! It's Hani Mukhtar pulling the strings again! Pico finishing it off! 1-0 Nashville! Just a fantastic run here from Hani Mukhtar, but it's the ability and the vision from Godoy to see this and see you later! Oh, Christopher McVeigh! Don't watch the eyes, don't watch the hips, watch the ball! Because the ball is ending up in the back of your net. It's 1 0. Nashville, take a bow. Hani Mukhtar. Goes back to Lovitz. Now Lovitz will float it in, looking for Bumbury. It was there for him, at least to send it back across into a dangerous area, and he didn't get it right. Second half underway. Already, Joseph making things a little more interesting. Nashville leading Miami 1-0 at Geodes Park. Mukhtar to Lovitz. Now back to Moore. Moore thinking about it from distance. It was blocked by Neville. Popped back in to Alex Mwil. Shaq Moore. Good ball! McNaughton is there! The new it's Nashville SC. Player scores to make it two. MLS goal for Lucas McNaughton. Pieces from Walker Zimmerman, but the second phase, they keep it alive. This ball back from Wheel allows Shaq Moore to hit it first time. And then it's the recycled run from Lucas McNaughton in behind Ryan Saylor. The easiest of finishes for any attacking player because the pace of the ball went perfectly any deflection. 2-0 Nashville here at home. No Walker Zimmerman. No problem. If Hani Mutar wants to go low, this could be a nightmare for Calendar. It will be Mukhtar and it's over the bar. He chose to try to get it up and over and was unable. Has now lifted Joseph a little bit more to being the guy we saw and got so used to in Atlanta. Oh no. Oh, this might be through. Bumbery behind. Bumbery is saved by Calendar. He keeps it in play. Miami have really struggled with the long balls from Nashville, right? The balls have been into this channel and particularly in behind McVeigh and on the right shoulder of Sailor. Teal Bumbery timing has run perfectly. And good on Calendar to come off his line. I mean, Ryan Saylor had a good chunk of Teal Bunbury's kid. Pico. Running at McVeigh. Fafa Pico cutting it back. Pico curling it. Held by Callender. Here is Joseph Martinez. His shot was blocked. Comes off of Miller. Capano first time over the bar. Now Robert Taylor. He is looking for Martinez. It's over his head. It's Mayer who's able to get it away. Pico trying to get a clear. It's not yet. Oh, acrobatic. And Martinez, the header, is saved by Willis. I mean, it's not rocket science. The guy's got 114 goals in all competitions. And where have they been? In front of goal. Because little deflections will pop your way. And so far, Miami have done a good job in the final third. But they need Campana and Martinez around Willis, around McNaughton, around Mayer, 
to then try to find those half a chances where he's made a living on. Campana drops off. You feel like Joseph maybe should pull up, but the one issue I have with both center forwards is they're making the same run at the same time. Now the corner for Miami. Oh, right at Willis from Campana. Leal gets a pack from Godoy. Nice combination up through. Schaffelberg might be behind. Frey in a foot race. Schaffelberg is in. Schaffelberg saved by Callender. Keeps Miami in the game. I mean, what is it about the end of the games for Nashville? It turns into a track meet. Sean will take it for Miami. Arroyo is there and it's in. Willis came, didn't get it. Wonderful finish from Dixon Arroyo, who has scored what is most likely a consolation goal for Miami to ruin Joe Willis's clean sheet. It's two to one. Where the supporting cast is, Joe Willis did a good job. It's just Arroyo's in the right spot. Naughton comes out. Joe Willis could have done a little bit more with that. But how's this for a finish from Dixon Arroyo? It just may be too little too late. It is. One that was dominated by Nashville from the opening whistle. Inter Miami tried at the end. They get a late consolation goal.